Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna make the most important meal of the day. Breakfast! Of course, this is not an English breakfast. This is a Thai breakfast. Okay, let's start. All you need is minced pork, one onion, coriander, spring onion, garlic, chili. Of course, it's chili cooking. You need chili. You have rice. I'm making this for my brunch, so I'm gonna use 150 gram rice because you don't have to skip your breakfast. I almost forgot, guy. The rice have to be cooked but if you don't know how to cook the rice guys I'm gonna leave the link here for you and also guys you need a mixing bowl like this don't have to be a mixing bowl could be a bowl and also you need a ring cutter this side you can use the cookie one as well it's fine and also you need a non-stick tray flat, flat like this okay now okay guys before I start cutting all ingredients let's make hot water Let's put the cutter on. You need a pan like this, okay? So it's a pan like this. Okay, now we're gonna start with the garlic first. Crush them. Get the skin off. Okay. And then just slow chop them. Then Fine chop. Don't have to be too fine. What we do, we're gonna marinate with pork. Okay. Now, what we're gonna do, guys, put this minced pork in a mixing bowl. Garlic. Now, this onions. We want some onions now. Peel them off. All we need is half onion, so we can keep that for just something else. Keep in the fridge. Okay, peel in. Yeah. Okay. What we do? We can slice it, but leave the edge. You're not gonna slide through there. You leave just about one centimeter. So what we're gonna do? Put that, like that, like that, like that. Okay. All you need just slice it half to the edge, and then another half up to the top there. And then see the magic. Now we very thin. Look at that guy. Okay, keep going. And after this, you can keep this bit, not a waste. Keep it for cooking at time. Okay, now we can put this onion mixing with the pork and garlic. Okay, nice and easy. Let me wash my hands. So now. What we have here, we have sesame oil, okay? And a bit of olive oil. What we do, we're gonna put a bit of olive oil in. And sesame oil, just a tiny bit. Okay, and one more thing guys, you can use any soya or dark soya is fine. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna just drop in there, just for the texture, just a tiny bit. Okay. So now, Get the spoon, we're gonna mix to make a burger. Okay. You can put salt and pepper, whatever you like, but for me, the um, dark soya is a bit salty already, so I don't need it. Okay. So what we're gonna do next, mix them nicely. We're going to place it into the ring by using a small spoon. Okay, now, now 
place it like that. Okay. Go round and round. This burger is going to take around 15 to 20 minutes to cook. It doesn't take long at all. Again, guys, you don't have to be pork, it could be beef, minced beef, it could be anything you like, you fancy. And this thing is very good for baby to have it. My son had it when he was six, seven months. And you know it? Yep, there you are. It's going to take about 15, 20 minutes. 180 degrees around 15 20 minutes okay put it in okay so next okay guys if it's your first time making burger if you don't feel confident in case like it's gonna break when it's cooked you can leave this ring with it so 100 percent it's gonna hold okay okay yeah now we've got um burgers in cooking now while we're waiting for burgers we're gonna finish the last ingredient last three so Spring onion, slice them, eat it. Thin slice. This all of this is gonna be garnish guy, okay? At the place, now some coriander. Just roughly chopped really. Have to be thin together. And now, chili. If you're not fancy chili, you can leave on the side. Because when you have, um, give it to the baby, you can do without chili. But, juby, without chili is not juby. Okay, now guys, let's move on to this. We're gonna move everything next to the pan. Let's put the hot water into the pan. Oh, you need about half, almost half of the saucepan, okay? About 1.5 liters, so. There you go. And then, full power on. Okay. okay. I'm going to put about two spoons, two teaspoons of chicken powder. In Thai cooking, we use a lot of chicken powder. It's like chicken stock, basically. Now, you get a whisk, like this. It. And this dish is called in Thailand we call junk. <laughs> it's not junk, it's a junk. <laughs> okay? Because this is kind of like give you lots of carbs because we put egg as well. We're gonna put egg at the end. I'm gonna show you. Now put the rice in. In Thailand people have this for breakfast. It's not too heavy, okay? Let it boil in now. Okay guys, this this dish, you need to keep whisking it. You're gonna spend time a lot whisking, okay? But you try not to stop whisking it, okay? And this rice, this joke, is gonna become the porridge, like a porridge. This is very good for the baby, but my son love it. We give it to him when he was Six months, seven months old, but instead of pork, we gave him beef, minced beef, yeah. And he loved it, he loved it. Still now, it's keep whisking it, let it boil a bit. Stop whisking a bit, let it boil a bit. Now, when it's boiling, come back whisking again. It's going to take some time, okay? Now while we're skin, let me go. You can check the burger. Ooh, that is lovely. Back to my skin. Go down a bit. Now you can see the lights start boiling now. Let it go for now. Risk, risk, risk. This dish, you have to give a bit of effort, okay? You got his pink. 
could be sweating at me. Whisk it in. Whisk it time to time. When you start boiling, whisk it again. Start boiling, whisk it again. Whisk, whisk, whisk. Now time to time. Let it boil again. This dish, guys, is perfect for breakfast, okay? It's lots of carbs, keep your energy. It's very good when you start off the diet because your body is what you eat. You eat healthy food, you can be healthy, you know? That's a life. Keep missing it now, miss, miss, miss. Gonna take time, guys. Don't give up. Never give up. Um, see you guys. I'm making this pork burger. Oops. It doesn't have to be pork burger. You can have beef, salmon, any kind of fish. Vegetarian, like tofu burger. You can chop them up. You can put the what we do, marinated garlic, a bit soya, sesame seed, everything. But guys, let me know if you guys want me to do the vegan dish. So we can do it sometimes, okay? Okay guys, just keep risking it. You don't have to risk all the time, maybe 20 minutes and then you can do something else. You know, come back, keep an eye on it, time to time. Now, it's this stage, start boiling up. It's coming up, the flour of the rice just been coming up now. It's nearly there, what we're looking for at this stage, okay? I'm like a glue, like a porridge. Keep whisking it. Keep whisking it. Okay, now let bring it up. Bring it up, and then whisking it. Bring it down again. It's almost there, guys. Now whisking it, and then let it go. Let it come up again. And then bring it down again. Bring it down again, guys. Almost there now. Okay. Go. Bring it down again. Keep doing this time to time until you, the stage you've been looking for, okay? And we can, I'm going to show you what you're looking for. Keep risking again. I know it's a bit of work to do, guys, this bitch, but the result will give you the best of the breakfast. Healthy. Okay, risking it. Okay now, guys, let's check the consistency now. I think it's nearly there. Get the spoon. Almost there. Like say one or two minutes. Keep this unit. Okay guys, what we're looking for is like glue consistency. Like consistent of the glue, sickness, fine porridge. Nearly there, okay? Now you can see when you're whisking, they come together now. It's nearly there. You can see it. You can slow down. Yeah, almost there. Okay, let's do one minute. Keep, it, keep risking it. Okay, guys, now I think it's ready. Turn it off. Just want to check it. Turn it off. Keep risking it a bit. It's what we're looking for. Okay, slow it. Now, keep spoon. Perfect. This is perfect. Right, next one we're going to do. Crack the egg, raw egg, one egg, into the bowl, what we're going to eat. Mm. Okay. Now, slowly make sure guys get a cloth, okay, it's very hot. Slowly pull it into the egg. Don't be scared guys, because this glue, you're talking about more than 180 degrees, 200 degrees, it's going to cook the egg. Slicer, put my burger out. It's on top. Ah, my garnish, got chili. One day shot earlier on, with chili, spring onion, coriander.
what I love the most, my favorite ingredients, garnish, is dry shallot. You can get in any Asian supermarket, sell it cheap in the bag. What I'm gonna do, it's a dry shallot, okay? It's healthy, it's very healthy. On top, then finish off with dark soy sauce. Okay, just a tiny bit, go for it. That's it, okay? Look at that, guys. This is a joke. It's not a joke. It's take a bit of time to make. But this dish, moms can make it for baby. It's very healthy. But don't forget, we have chili for the baby. You can do like I said earlier on. You can have salmon, fish, beef instead of pork, whatever you fancy. Okay? This is what I cook, guys. This is what I eat. Healthy. From me to you. Thanks for watching. See you next week. Love you all. If you want more recipe from me, don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Oh, I almost forgot guys. I'm gonna leave there for about five, 10 minutes. It's boiling hot. It's gonna burn your tongue. Just leave it, let it taste, about 10 minutes, come back and eat it, okay? Love you.